My blades and I are ready. Choose your opponent. I'll fight this king of the bandits. Do you hear? You must have done well in there. Did you not see? I haven't seen a fight from inside the arena in years. But if the crowds are cheering like that, perhaps I have a hero on my hands after all. Of course they cheer for me. Who could resist cheering for a warrior legend in the arena? Maybe the stories I've heard are true. Skura? Aeon? Ah, Mistyas. I knew it as soon as I laid eyes on you. You could be 
could be hero of the arena like Skura. If you keep fighting, I foresee a long and profitable career for both of us. Talk to Skura when you're ready to continue. Hope is there to politiri. Choose your opponent. I have unpaid debts to collect. I see. Anyone in particular come to mind? Choose your opponent. I will spear Velos like a wild animal. Come on. 
Your blade, Mistyos. The spear. It reminds me of long ago. Of the Persians. This spear has killed many Persians. As have I. On the battlefield and in the arena. You fought in the Persian Wars? I did. What was that like? Hard. The Persians were a formidable enemy. They had the numbers. They had warriors from atolled conquered lands in their armies. It took a united Greek war to turn them back. Anything less would have been total defeat. A united Greek world? Seems like fantasy now. Agreed. But coming back from the war was harder than the war itself. Mayon and I found daily life afterwards to be... difficult. We had been men filled with life and death purpose. We found that again in the arena. What was the arena like in your time? It was a place of honor and heroism. I bathed my blade in blood for years. But that was a different time, and I was a different man. How exactly did you become a hero of the arena? What did you do? I survived. I have to go. You've done a warrior's job in the arena. Keep it up. Thank you.
You insignificant peon! Tell me where he is, or by era I'll burn this clinic to the ground with you in it! I already told you what I know! I don't ask much. Hippocrates must show humility to ensure public order. Prostrate himself before the gods and declare that his skills are gods given. But that won't help his patience. It'll just take him away from his work. If Hippocrates thinks he can disrupt social order to make himself into a demigod of healing, well... Perhaps the gods themselves will have their revenge. I'm sure there's no need for raised voices. Who are you? I'm looking for a man named Hippocrates. Yet another crazed follower of the madman himself. Tell your impious master that unless he makes a public apology and soon, this priestess of Ira will gather an army of faithful and shut him down. Out of my way! Oh, thank all the gods she's gone! I thought she was going to kill me this time. What's going on? I am Sostratos. Crisis has accused my master Hippocrates of impiety. Is he impious? He believes that beyond praying, people can take their health into their own hands and make themselves well. Fascinating. Can I speak with him? I'm sorry, he isn't here. Is this his workshop? It's Hippocrates' clinic. Here we study healing, offer treatments, and provide care to anyone who asks. Why not work with the priests in the sanctuary of Asclepios? It's what this region is known for, right? 
The priests try their best, but their methods are stuck in the past. Hippocrates is researching new cures and treatments. I need to meet Hippocrates. Is he in Argolis, at least? Yes, but he's gone southeast of Hera's watch to help the sick and injured. I'll find him. If you're going to meet Hippocrates, could I trouble you with a small errand? Depends what it is. I want you to bring him some equipment. He was in such a hurry, he left it behind. What kind of equipment? It's just medical necessities. Knives and gut for sutures, bandages. Oh, and uh, an enema bag for clearing the bowels. That bars. had to better be properly wrapped. I could bring that to Hippocrates. Really? I'll be sure he gets the equipment. You have my thanks. How will I know when I've found Hippocrates? Follow the road southeast of Hera's watch to the cave of Pan. He won't have set up far from it. Look for a long line of sick people. He's uh, balding, but I wouldn't mention that if I were you. <laughs> Many sick people. Can one man help all of them? I thought they were exaggerating when they said people from all around came to see Hippocrates. So, what has caused this man's condition? An excess of phlegm, Doctor. In the immediate sense, yes. But more importantly, he suffers from neglect. Neglect? Good food, warm clothing, so much could have helped. But since other caretakers assumed his condition was a punishment from the gods, they neglected him. Challenging tradition. You must be Hippocrates. Yes, I'm also very busy. This will only take a moment. 
I won't keep you away from your patients and your students. Observation, experience, and experimentation are crucial for treatment. My followers are learning that. I've come from your clinic in Argos. Sostratos asked me to give you this. I knew I forgot some things. Sostratos is a good physician, but a better apprentice there is none. Did you ask him to pay you for this delivery? No. I knew this would help you and your patients. That's good enough for me. Quite admirable. What did you say your name was? Cassandra of Sparta. Well met, Cassandra of Sparta. What do you need? Hippocrates, I need your help. I was told you may have helped my mother. I'm trying to find her. But we see all kinds of mothers. They walk all day so that Hippocrates can see their children. Maybe the priests at the sanctuary of Asclepios can help. They keep detailed records of all who pass through. Please, Hippocrates, I came very far to meet you. As did this patient, and the one before him, and the one before her. My patients need me, but my notes on diseases of the mind were taken. Retrieve them, and I will help you find what you seek. Hurry, this patient doesn't have much time left. According to Sostratos, you don't like people mentioning your... you know. My what? Your hair. Or lack of it. Yes, yes. Make your jokes while walking around like one of Phidias' sculptures come to life. Where should I look for your notes? For Tyrins, not far from here. Perhaps they'll return them if you ask. Or they could prepare for a new battle. With me. Far be it for me to tell Amistios how to work, but please, for my sake, do not kill needlessly. Enough blood has been shed in this war. Did Chrysis take your notes? Ah, you've met the priestess. No, not her, but the local military commander. I can't fault his desperation. Those men suffer terribly from battle fatigue. She would have come here a long time ago with an injured baby. Are you sure she would have passed through the sanctuary of Asclepios? I was a young man then. When I encountered a situation beyond my skills, I would send the patient to the sanctuary. And these priests keep records of their patients? Yes, engraved in stone. The elder priest might remember. What was so interesting about these notes? They were my notes about diseases of the mind, including what the priests call the sacred disease. That's what this patient has. He's losing control of his limbs and throat, sometimes frothing at the mouth. I fear his breathing will stop next. I'll do my best with what you've told me. Good luck. We're depending on you. His notes are well guarded. Why? I should 
stay hidden if I don't want to fight. happening over there.
What are you doing here? Hippocrates sent me. Your commander stole his notes, and I think you have them. The ones written by the great Hippocrates himself. I'm sorry. They were burned in the last attack. What? You heard me. The medical tent was burned. At least I memorized the notes before we lost them. Now transcribe them when I have time, or when the war subsides. Then you'll have to come with me. A patient Hippocrates is treating will die without your help. I have a patient right here who needs my help. Can't someone else take care of this one? I'm the only doctor here. Now let me work. I'll wait here for you to finish. If I leave, what's stopping you from running away? Thinking like a mercenary. Guess I shouldn't be surprised. Then make yourself useful and bring me my bone forceps. Some idiot or another's always borrowing them. Then you'll come treat Hippocrates' patient? You have my word. Is this it? You aren't a half bad assistant. When I'm done with his surgery, I'll be honored to help Hippocrates. Might be limping for a while, but Apollo willing, they'll make a full recovery. I'll meet you there. Don't be late. <laughs> <laughs> 